Yo, what's going on, guys? It is Cynical, and welcome back to Jack 2, episode 4. Don't know what that was about, but anyway, guys, welcome back to Jack 2, episode 4. In the last episode, we made our way back to the pumping station. We protected Sig, yada, 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 fucking yada. And now we are, I, I believe, we're going you into the sewer, I think. I don't know. Useful, eh? We'll find out. Mm, I have another task for you. The sewers used to be a fabulous... Right, there, there we go. The confirmation is real. Baron installed security devices. <laughs> We're going Never into the sewers. those late night snack Great. runs kept you from fitting out the front door. I bet you've hatched another brilliant plan in that hungry little brain of yours. So, who or what do we have to shake down, knock out, or blow up? Well... <laughs> Jack knows what's I up. I need <laughs> someone to go down and shoot every sentry gun in the sewers. And... I'll give you a sweet weapon upgrade if you succeed. Alright. Let me guess. Right. Dank murky water? Dank. Makes worse than your breath Dank. at an oyster fest? Fuller of metal heads than your plate at a one pass buffet? And of course, weapons more lethal than your ever so tidy whiteys on a <laughs> hot summer day? Look, Donut Hole. Why don't we float around here looking hot and heavy, and you go roto-root the pipes? We're not doing anything until you tell us why metalheads are trading with the Baron's forces. Oh, I should have had you both kneecapped, eh? All I know Damn, that's is brutal. Kneecapped? With a metalhead leader. Damn. Metalheads need eco, so the Baron supplies them with regular shipments. In return, the Metalheads agree to attack the city just enough to satisfy the Baron's continued rule. <laughs> yeah, but how long can that deal last? Well, the Baron is running short on eco, eh? And the Metalheads are short on patience. Baron Praxis needs this wall to keep in power. Otherwise, the city would put the true ruler on the throne. Wherever that little brat is. Daxter and I will clear your sewers. And we haven't forgotten about that weapons upgrade you promised in return. Alright, yeah, suckers. exactly. You offered me the, the weapon upgrade, dude. Don't call me a bloodsucker. Alright, anyway, let's go. Let's go to the sewers. I love how involved Jack has become. With everything that is going on. I mean, I know that he wants revenge and, and shit like that on Baron Praxis. Like, that is literally this game right now. Um, and that is, you know, obviously Jack getting revenge towards Baron Praxis for basically experimenting on him for two years. Like, Jack is pissed off, and his one and only goal is to kill the Baron, like he blatantly said at the start of the game. But, you know... Jack's probably only been here for like two days and already he's become like extremely involved in what is going on. I just find that so hilarious. It's great though. It, it, it's fucking awesome. Like, you know, it, it goes to show that Jack doesn't play. Like, he's, he's not playing. He's, he's for real, dude. He, he, he will fuck shit up if he has to and I love that about him. I, that is an aspect that I do like about him in, in Jack 2 and 3. You know, he's, he's pissed off. I mean, he's, he's significantly more pissed off in number 2 than he is number 3. Uh, but you know, you can't help but kind of enjoy it, uh, you know. Anyway, uh, we're here, sewer entrance, like I've kind of mentioned. Um, yeah, I don't exactly like the sewers. The sewers are... Eh, meh, you know, anyway, I don't know, I don't know. I, I find that you go back to these areas, um, quite a bit. Like, res like they kind of recycle the areas. It's good that they add, like, uh new areas to those areas that you already visit if you know what I'm trying to say you should probably have no idea I'm trying I'm, I'm probably making this extremely confusing for you guys <laughs> I'm just gonna shut up I'm just, I'm just gonna shut up dude like <laughs> but yeah um, obviously later on we're gonna be going down there on our hoverboard which is actually also very exciting the hoverboard Shoot the gun, Jack. Let me get real close Real. That explosion stays there for too long. All right, I remember this part. This part right here. I that used to scare the shit out of me, dude, when I was younger. Like, I'm not even joking. Holy damn! Like, that would n make my nipples rock fucking hard, dude. That that would scare the shit out of me, dude, when I was younger. Like, damn, bro. Holy, he just comes out of fucking nowhere. <laughs> Fuck 
fuck out of here, bro. All right. We good. We good. We good. We good. I'm very keen on that weapon mod because, of course, we get the rifle um, after this, I believe. That is the next weapon that we get, and uh, the spinny kind of move that you can do with it is really, really good. Like you can just basically kill anything in the area, which is great. Uh, it is better in Jack 3 with the reflection mod, the reflector mod, how it bounces off the walls and stuff. Bloody oath, this is good work, dude. You wouldn't be able to do it. All right. Oh. This part, this part. I give you a buttload of dark eco right here. But we still don't have enough to become dark jack. That kind of sucks because what you do here is you activate dark jack and then do dark bomb and they get fucking annihilated. But oh, dude, I don't have dark jack. This is gonna be interesting. The spread on this gun is crazy. Though. Okay, there is no dark eco. No, there is when we kill these guys. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, we basically killed them all already anyway. Damn. We, however, nearly died in the process, but I love how we can become Dark Jack right when we kill all of them. That is great. The Dark Ego to me also always looked like candy. Like purple grape flavored candies. I don't I don't know if anybody else gets that vibe from it. I do though, because you know that's me. <laughs> Imagination. <laughs> right, let's make our way up. Oh shit. Dude, I didn't even see you there. These cute little bastards are sneaking up on me, man. Right. Oh, dude. No, 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 no. Okay, we good, we good. We need health, though, like ASAP. Right, give me that juicy health. Give me that juicy health. I mean, it'd be scarier if you didn't have your bright heads, because, like, I can see them from a mile away. Oh, dude, no. Really? Right at the fucking end of it? Are you, are you joking me? That is, that is absolutely so unfortunate. Yeah, I love how you have to start right back here. We have to do that all again? No! That's some that's some hard shit. Alright, alright. I like I like how they put it. Stick it to you hard. That's great. Yeah, I know you're there, buddy. I know you're there, dude. Alright, this time we'll use Dark Jack. We won't play around. We've actually got Dark Jack. We ain't playing this time. We're not playing. Speedrunner strats, guys. Speedrunner strats. Dude, there's like an army of like enemies right there. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Let's do it. This is literally the best place to use that, like Dark Bomb. Like, it, it is so good. Boom! Love that slow motion effect. It's just so on point. So on point. Alright. Kinda mad that we died. <laughs> I was kinda hoping to go like quite a few episodes without dying, but that that just kinda seems impossible. I love how they make it so that the uh, the turret can't, you know, aim vertical. <laughs> that would help a lot for their benefit, but I ain't complaining. Alright, we got this this time. We got plenty of health as well. There we go. Alright, nice. Yes! Put me in the sewer! You put me in this monster infested sewer that smells probably like dead fish and shit. Because, you know, that's what happens in sewers. Sewers probably smell like shit. And. Yeah, it's not pleasant. 
It's, it's not pleasant, dude. I can tell you that much, Cruz. So, you, you better be thankful, man. You better be fucking thankful. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's go. Let's go, Mr. Elevator. Entering Haven City. Mm, Alright. That could have gone smoother. I'm not gonna lie. That could have gone smoother, but... Unfortunately... It didn't. Let's go, neighborino. Back to the bar. Alright. Slow and steady. Slow and steady. I'm, I'm, I'm happy there's no speed limits in the city. Because I am just full throttling it right now, dude. I don't give a fuck. I'm just, like, o overtaking everyone. Like, everyone is, like, casually following each other. They're braking. They're going at a nice speed. There is literally no thrusters in sight at the back of their vehicles, but me, no, I'm fucking boosting past everyone. I've got my, like, flames coming out the back of my Zuma. I'm in a rush, dude. I gotta get shit done fast. <laughs> Alright. And we're here. Alright. Beautiful work. Beautiful work. What is that horrible smell? Ah, oh, you just put us in a sewer. We do your dirty work in a sewer. What do you think the smell is? Worse than a wet hip hog in a warm barn. This could have a serious impact on the lady factor. No. I think it was my lunch. Oh, okay, that explains it. That explains nice it. Nice work in the sewers, eh? I guess you're looking for that weapon upgrade. Mm. Well, there's a blast of mod stashed in some crates at the port. Find it, and it's yours. <laughs> you, you, literally, you're that fucking lazy. You can't even hand me over the weapon mod. You, you, you make me go find the weapon mod. You, you're playing, dude. I, that, he's shady. He's shady. I don't like him. He's shady. Alright. Oh, I suppose we're gonna be testing out the, uh, the new mod, though, the, the that weapons so course. That makes sense. Alright, that makes sense. Let's go. Nice. Nice. Yeah, it works so much better in Jack 3. So, this is a good gun. This is a good gun. It's like the gun that you use the most in this game. You can combo your attacks by kicking and firing your weapon. <clears throat> kick the first target, then shoot while kicking to automatically hit the second target. I mean, I wouldn't call that a kick. Not quite. Try again. Kick, then shoot, almost at the same time. Kick. That's a wastelander. I mean, I wouldn't call that a kick. That's more like a gump, punt, gun, punt, gump, punt. What? <laughs> I don't know what that is, but anyway. <clears throat> Alright, let's go. Yeah, dude, I... Yeah, yeah, wait, we're doing it. Alright, we're going this way. So. Okay, let's not shoot the kid. Let's not shoot the kid! <laughs> that would go good on my resume, so... Yeah, man shoots kid at, at gun course. Nice. He was very accurate, as it has been described. Oh, dude, alright. through this dude I just saw that gold one at the corner of my eye nearly shot the kid again all right we're good we're chilling we're chilling oh dude okay all right oh dude okay 
Dude, dude, come on, man. Come on. Oh, dude. Did I get one of them? I don't suppose this thing penetrates, so, you know. Alright, easy, easy. No, oh, wow. So I got a fucking pop up from one of those things. I feel like we could be doing better, like, honestly. Well, that's, that's, that's obvious. <laughs> Give me more targets, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. That's good, that gold one. No, it can't be the end. No. Was, no. Alright, all right, we got we got bronze. We got bronze. I'm I'm happy with the bronze. We get a precursor out of it, so you know. You know how it is. You know how it is. All right. Okay, I'm. I'm Sammy Walt kind of happy about it. I. I we could have done better, <laughs> honestly. But anyway, turning back to the the bar to see what's going on there. See where our next mission will, of course, take us. So let's let's go do that. I am happy that we do have the good gun now, though, because the shotgun is honestly not that great. You like have to get right up close and personal to actually inflict damage with the shotgun. So I'm happy we have the. Uh, the rifle mod. I have a proposition for you, Jack. Racing is the biggest sport in the city. Errol is the Alright, we're going to the stadium. Champion. Let's go. He's crazy and dangerous on the track. <laughs> My kind of guy. Only a fool would dare race against him, eh? And that's where you two come in. A client of mine is looking for a fast driver for her racing team. Here's a security pass to get you into the stadium section. All right, stadium uh, section. Here we go. With just a few trifles for me, <laughs> I've uh, already signed your name to save time. Hmm? We, the racers, hereby agree to give crew all proceeds from race earnings, endorsement fees, broadcast royalties, syndication residuals, vehicle sponsorships, small appearance fees, collectible card assets, fast food tie-ins, use of likeness rights, talk show deals, clothing lines, all print rights, including book, novella, comic pamphlet. Ticket tape, neon sign, and bathroom graffiti designs. <sighs> Toy rights, shoe lines, mood rings, game rights. Game rights? Vitamin endorsements, city kickback, movie deals, and of course, all death and dismemberment accident insurance claims. <laughs> we can work out the tiny details later. If you can get from here to the race garage near the stadium in less, less than, than three, three minutes. minutes, all right. My client said she would consider letting you drive for her team. <clears throat> Make me proud. Mm. Yeah, so basically, crew gets everything we win, essentially. Well, all the decent stuff, anyway. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's go, big boy. Let's go, big boy. We're on our way, big boy. Alright. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Alright, we should be good. We should be good. I I'll have you know, I'm a Crash Team Racing professional, so this ain't nothing for me. <laughs> No, I kid. I kid. I remember getting frustrated at CDR all the time when I was a kid. It was excellent stuff. I, I, I honestly hope that uh, the guards won't come after me this time. I don't think they will, because we're not trying to smuggle anything into another sector. We're simply just trying to get from point A to point B in a certain amount of time. Not, I just bold an innocent civilian. Nice. Five points to Gryffindor. <laughs> Alright, easy, easy around the corners, boy. This is Unit Alpha. We're uh, we got this, we got this. I think I think we do. I don't wanna speak too soon though. But I feel like we got this. Maybe. Oh, okay, let's not hit that guy, because he he won't be too thrilled with that. Alright. So far we haven't crashed, and uh, that's putting a smile on the crocodile, so go us. Right. Easy, easy. The slum part is like huge though, oh shit, okay, alright, let's, we're about to blow up. I Everything I just said 
bounce back to me, dude. Holy duck goose chicken. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good, fam. 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 We still got this. I thought we had to use the same vehicle to get there, but no. No. No, we can use the different vehicle. Holy chicken fucking enchiladas on a Sunday morning. This is intense stuff. Oh my god. All right. Easy now, children. We go in the wrong way, too. Oh, Derry, we have 40 seconds. I, I, I still believe, guys. I still believe. <laughs> I told you guys I speak too soon about things. Like, I literally do. It's so bad. All right, I think we got this, though. We definitely have this in the cat bag. There we go. Beautiful work. And then I just randomly die. That'd be awesome. No, there we go. Perfect work. Uh, hello? Crew said someone was looking for a race driver? I'm busy right now. You must be Crew's new errand boy. Look, I don't mean to be rude. You did get here fast. But I'm not interested in any new drivers right now. And I've got work to do. Is there anything we can do? No! I'm uh, working on a secret uh, uh, vehicle project. Okay, sorry. Listen, if you think you've got the guts to race in this town, try taking my prototype jet board out on the stadium court. Beat the stadium challenge and maybe right, I'll we'll get that juicy, juicy jet board, man. <laughs> Jack, please. Jack, please. Focus on the mission, dude. <laughs> Focus on the mission. Alright guys, well that's going to cut it for episode 4. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the Jack 2 Let's Play thus far. In the next episode, we're going to be going into the stadium and we're going to be doing some Tony Hawk tricks and flips and whatnot and all that great stuff with the jet board. So look forward to that in episode 5. But otherwise guys, I've been Cynical. Hopefully you've enjoyed episode 4. And until next time, I'll catch you guys later. Peace.